Oh, it's summertime already. <laughs> Wait, no, I messed it up. How did I mess it up? I wrote the script. I'm so dumb. Oh, would you look at the time? It's summertime already. That means two things are about to happen. One, we're about to spend all our money on Steam Summer sales. Like, that's just gonna happen. Like, Gaben, please. And two, Britain's about to be hella hot for like a couple of months now. Boy, do I have the solution for you. Just buy a fan, like this one. Now I'm be honest with you, they can be a bit loud. Which means that most nights I have to choose between not being able to go to sleep because of the heat or not being able to go to sleep because of this thing is just... Just all the time. Like, it's... It's a powerful fan. It's just very loud. So, do you know what we're doing today, Ferb? We're gonna turn this... We're gonna turn this, which is like a, a port thing in my, in my wall that I have that lets, like, air through. We're gonna stick some computer fans into that and make it run off a battery instead of my computer and it'll be good because we can make we can make my room cold. Hello and welcome to the first installment of soldering with your boy knock knock. It's like soldier boy. So we've got the positive wire of the battery pack going into the switch that we're gonna use, and the switch goes click click, surprisingly. And now I've got my very hot solder, uh, soldering iron here. Ouch, it's hot. Listen, I've got all my proper PPE. I'm only like really shaky because caffeine. Oh no, just stop shaking me, please. Oh, this is good, all the fumes are going straight into my nose. Look at this. I mean, it's an awful job, and the switch might be broken, but that is a good solder. That is a very good solder, I think. No. Hello and welcome to the first ever episode of Cardboard with your boy Notna. Welcome. So what we're doing right now, I don't actually know. Um, I'm making the thing that the actual fans are gonna go to. So I've got everything done. I put some insulating cellar tape. I don't know if that's a thing, but watch. Flick the switch right here. Flick, and they turn on. Flick, and they turn off. I mean, they're on ball pairing, so it takes a little bit. But yeah, got my 9 volt battery and everything. All of these are doing fine. Put some uh, heat shrink onto this, which I haven't actually heat shrunk, but it's, it's good enough. So now we need the thing that it's gonna like actually attach to. So what I've got here as my weapon of choice is my <laughs> is my mom's sewing utensil scissors, as you can see here. They're okay for doing like sewing stuff, but maybe not as good for cardboard, but they're working all right. Wapam, boom, I've cut a hole into cardboard. And see, a normal person might attach this to the fans in like a normal way or something like that. But you know me, I don't do things in a normal way. So you know what I'm gonna do? <laughs> I'm gonna use hot glue. <laughs> this is my life hacks video, let me plug this in. Today, we're showing you how to make a fan out of computer fans. Yeah, that wasn't funny. Bro, zoom zoom makes this look so easy. My friend Carol is saying that I should just do the snap like Michael Reeves. Let's try it. Hey, you what's what's popping, low gang? It's your boy Notna here, and bada bim bada boom bada bim bada boom bada bim bada boom bada boom, bada boom, bada boom. I've got this. It's got a switch on it, right? You switch the switch. They go on. You switch the switch again. They turn off when you like. You kind of have to tell them to turn off. Bada bim bada boom. So now we gotta we gotta attach this. We have to attach it up there. I'm gonna switch to that right now. Hello, it's your boy. There you go. These screws are actually long enough to go through the cardboard. And this filter paper that I have, don't know where this is from or what it's actually used for. I'm gonna use it to filter out the spiders that always come into my room through this vent thing. Not good. Okay, now my guess is that this, this vent's gonna have a lot of uh, spiders. <laughs> 
because that's where the spiders always come into my room from. They're always coming through this net. So, adding filter paper and some spinning saw blades of death in front of the spider's entrance location might deter them, I hope. That's beautiful. Now, this should come off. Oh, that's a lot of spider webs. That's a lot of spider webs. Don't know if you can see that. Probably not, but still, that's a lot of spider webs, my guys. No wonder spiders keep coming into my room. We're gonna cut out this to look like the thing that I'm trying to make. This is this, is this and it will go here perfectly like so to filter out all the nasty spiders. Screw spiders, am I right? Okay. Hey, that's nice, it works. It actually works. I'm very surprised about this. I'm still attaching it to the actual wall. Yeah, don't do that. Yeah, maybe I'll uh, turn this off. Ouch. I should have remembered, you know, the whole thing that I built this. This looks so bad. Oh my god. Yeah. I feel like that's good. That's tight enough. That's good enough. Now that's... Now that's good enough. No. 90% of this is sellotape. Sellotape them underneath the protective surface. Protective of what? I don't know. Does any of this look like I know what I'm doing? Didn't think so. But? No. Yes! They spooked me there. They spooked me. They got me. Oh, god damn it. Well, that's fun. I am so upset. Okay, let me fix this and I'll get right back at you. Because all we've done now is we've just put a put a filter there. That's not that's no bueno. I don't want that. So I'm gonna use these 3M sticky pads that I used to put up the soundproofing. See these these were like meant to put up like paintings and stuff on walls, I think. So they're basically being used for what they were made for here. In in the fact that this is this is art that I'm putting up. Oh boy, are these sticky. Will this work? That will work. And... Ooh! Baby, a triple. This sticks on so well. Wow! And that... is how you make... a DIY AC out of some old computer fans. Thanks for watching. My name's been Nokna. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and all that other youtuber -y stuff. See you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Ye yeet! That was a masterpiece of a video, wasn't it? For more content like this, consider subscribing! Bingo bango bongo! Bish bash bosh! Peace! Peace.